Hey everybody, I'm Jamie Scott Kataya of JSA. This is your monthly industry news headlines. Three minutes tops. Let's try this out. Click on the logo over my shoulder if you want to hear more details of the story. Kicking off our headlines, a new agreement between Bandwidth IG, a Metro Dark Fiber provider in Northern California and Greater Atlanta, and QTS Realty Trust, making the quick transmission of data in Silicon Valley a little easier. Bandwidth IG worked with QTS to create a custom solution constructing a new completely diverse entrance with QTS in the QTS Santa Clara campus. Heading down south to sunny SoCal, the cloud scene heating up there, continuing with the theme of ensuring its customers have the very best cloud options, Edge Connects announcing Telia Carrier has expanded its network within the Edge Connects Edge data center in San Diego. Over to Utah, Databank's SLC5 data center is giving Silicon Slopes an edge. Databank just announced expansion of its facility there which is strategically located in the company's Granite Point North Campus Complex in Rockdale, Utah. This data center is located in the heart of Silicon Slopes and Utah's growing tech ecosystem. As our previous headlines testified, data centers hot market right now. Of course, global data center investment poised to increase from $244 billion in 2019 to $432 billion in 2025. To meet this expanding demand, Kohler Power, the data center industry's global power partner, just unveiled its Global Power Partner Program, delivering 24-7 ongoing and tailored support for data centers clients, requiring the power solutions capable of helping build tomorrow's data landscape. Let's go ahead and head southeast now to Atlanta EX Squared Technology, just announcing the completion of the advanced communication network that transforms 15.8 miles of the Atlanta Beltline into a smart city corridor. EX Squared working with Atlanta Beltline Inc. there to design and deploy the communications network consisting of a multi-duct and fiber optic network system. And exciting news out of the Lion City, enterprises, cloud providers, multinationals seeking colo capacity in Singapore, in Singapore now have an exciting new option, Big Data Exchange or BDX, one of the fastest growing data center clusters in Asia Pacific, just announcing completion of the first phase of capacity upgrades at SIN1, the company's award-winning Singapore data center. Stream Data Center is an industry leader delivering turnkey powered shell and build a suit data center solutions for global enterprises. Proud to announce its recent recognition of, with an EPA certification. Yes, the US Environmental Protection Agency awarded Stream's Chicago Data Center in Elk Grove Village with a 2021 Design to Earn the Energy Star Certificate of Achievement. Talking Chicago, of course, the largest, third largest city in the US now home to Cross Lake Fiber's new on-ramp location at 350 East CERMAC. Of course, we know CERMAC, the major data center, key location for financial service firms, network service providers. Now, customers can gain access to Cross Lake's Velocity Trading Network platform with a multitude of asset engines housed in or near 350 East CERMAC. And shifting now to pandemic stories, we have, uh, of course, the pandemic shedding a light on the digital inequities in communities across America. Uh, YMCA seeking to keep communities connected by developing programming that increases internet access for all people they serve. They uh, reached out and worked with Horizon, a fiber optic broadband company operating out of Columbus, Ohio. Horizon selected by the YMCA of Central Ohio to provide enhanced dedicated internet access and hosted voice solutions. Also, as we know, our homes serving triple duty these days, work, play, learning hubs, consolidated communications meeting that demand by bringing fiber upgrades to more than 300,000 residents this year across seven states and the work well underway. Most recently completed work includes build outs in Vermont and California that will upgrade existing speeds or bring symmetrical one gig internet to new locations entirely. This upgrade in the new fiber builds are part of a five year fiber to the premises plan announced last December, which is gonna upgrade 1.6 million locations across consolidated's 23 state footprint. Unbelievable. Congrats guys. And again, sign of the times, we need to pivot during this pandemic. Well, Comstar Technologies created a versatile and effective solution, the Comstar Collaboration Card which was just named a 2021 Pandemic Tech Innovations Award winner. So congrats, Comstar. That collaboration cart created after a client, a sports and fitness industry leader, reached out to Comstar seeking a solution for their immunocompromised members. Love that. For us in Sullivan, just called it, guys, NetSapiens, the San Diego 
B2B provider of UCAS and contact center solutions to service providers, is the third party platform provider with the fastest growth rate in North America. Ranked fourth by UCAS seats overall in North America, NetSapiens now part of the conversation that includes other big names such as Cisco, Mitel, and Microsoft. Congrats, NetSapiens. And congrats also to Connected to Fiber. We love those guys. They had that company named Inc. Magazine's annual list of the best workplaces for 2021. Also note, Server Farm launched its new podcast, The Future of Data Centers. That's a mini podcast series from the viewpoint of server farmers and data growers. One to definitely check out. Lots of talk there with, uh, regarding its sustainability mission too. Great topic today. And congratulations to our media partner, Interglobics Magazine, releasing its sixth issue of the coveted publication. Mind you, the, like one of the best features there, they sit down with the father of the internet and Google chief internet evangelist, Vint Cerf, who shares his perspective on how the internet is changing the socioeconomic paradigm. Definitely a story not to miss. So check that out into Globix Magazine. All right, guys, that's a wrap for your monthly news headlines in three minutes top. Itch. <laughs> I'm Jamie Scott of JSA and happy networking.